Sorry. All right. Haha. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Ushman Sid Foods. As you may know, I've been fasting for the past year to try to lose some weight. But now I'm ready to eat food again, and I'm done with that fast. Because I actually started gaining weight. Um, I think it was because of all the milkshakes I was drinking. But come on, that was like the only thing I could consume. Because it's not food, it's a beverage. Anyways, I'm done fasting, and I was really excited to try solid food again. But like every grocery store is really low in inventory right now. For some reason. Like all of them. But that's okay because I had food in my pantry from before the fast. Specifically, only flour and this packet of salt. So today, I'm going to show you how to make a no need, no yeast bread. Because grocery stores are so low with bread, a lot of people are looking for really easy shortcuts on how to make it. So today, I'm going to show you the perfect recipe for making bread without learning any new skills or putting in any of the effort it takes that makes food actually taste good. All right, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we need is a mixing bowl. And to that bowl, we're gonna add a half a cup of cold water. You always wanna start with a liquid first, just like pouring a bowl of cereal. And for this recipe, you only need a cup of flour. But hold on, that was knead, N-E-E-D. Remember, this is a no knead bread. Okay, now mix it until the flour and water are ever so slightly incorporated. Remember, you're not kneading it. This is a no knead zone. Absolutely no kneading. Okay, and now, I mean, again, you can't knead it because you refuse to, so that's really all you can do. Pour that into a baking tray and be careful not to knead it. We wouldn't want you doing that. Now just shape it into a bread shape with your hands but don't expend too much energy, okay? You really don't want to cross that fine line between touching it with your hands and kneading it. God forbid, you have to learn how to knead. Cover the tray and put it into a 450 degree oven for 30 minutes. Then we're gonna bake it for another 20 minutes uncovered. But if kneading the bread and using yeast were already a deal breaker, let's be honest, this step is too involved for you, so just fucking send it, who gives a shit? Wow, look how well it turned out compared to this actual loaf of bread. Just fucking knead your dough. Use yeast. If you're gonna make bread, make it the right way. It's the oldest fucking food on the planet. I think they have the recipe right by now. There's a reason why you knead it and use yeast. Two techniques that are extremely easy. Why are people afraid of kneading dough? So if you're looking for shortcut recipes on how to make foods like bread, all I gotta say is <laughs> there's really just no need. I still gotta eat this. Honestly, with a little bit of sugar, this would be pretty good. So, okay, I take it all back. 